today I'm going to teach you how to make a complaint. All right? If you follow these steps and order, you have successfully made a complaint. Step one, decide what your complaint is. Step two, decide what you would like done about it. Step three, decide who to complain to. Step four, tell that person your complaint and what you would like done about it. Step five, ask if he or she can can and will do what you have suggested, all right? And step one, deciding what the complaint is, all right? Now, for example, if I'm in class and then someone just hit me, I would um, hit him back, but I know that would get me in trouble, so I wouldn't. So now, if I hit him back, I can't complain, because then the teacher gonna get both of us in trouble. But if I stop and be like, oh, that's a complaint, that's step one, all right? So the complaint is that he hit me. Step two. He said what I would like done about it. Well, if he hit me, I wouldn't want him to hit me again, so that's what I would like to be done about it. Step three, decide whom to complain to, right? Now, for different situations, the best person to complain to can be different people. So like in school, the best person would be to complain to is the principal or the teachers or a parent or someone like that, right? But in different situations, you have different people you can complain to. Maybe your cousin could be the best person to complain to in different situations. Sure. Step four, tell that, tell that person your complaint that what you would like done about it, right? Now, if a student hit me, right? and my complaint is that he hit me, I wouldn't want him to hit me again, so that's what I would like to be done about it. How? You have to make, you have to give the teacher a suggestion of how that wouldn't happen. Maybe setting him far away from you, or you know, ask if he could go in a different class, uh, have different schedules at different times, so that way you can prevent the problem. Step five, ask if the teacher can and will do what you have suggested. So that's basically just asking, um, excuse me miss, I don't think, a, B, and C should go, so then I would like you to do X, Y, and Z. All right? So do you understand? Yep. All right. Okay. Any questions? No. Nope. All right. Tell us your example now. Oh, I just gave it. Oh, you just gave that?